Ukrainian drones struck a large military depot in a town deep inside Russia overnight, causing a huge fire and forcing some residents to evacuate, a Ukrainian official and Russian news reports said Wednesday. At least 13 people were injured, Russia's health ministry added. Meanwhile, a senior U.S. diplomat said Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky has a workable plan to end the conflict, now in its third year, although its details have not been publicly disclosed. Ukraine claimed the strike destroyed military warehouses in Toropets, a town in Russia's Tver region about 380 kilometers northwest of Moscow and about 500 kilometers from the border with Ukraine. The attack was carried out by Ukraine's security service, along with Ukraine's intelligence and special operations forces, a Kyiv security official told the Associated Press, speaking on condition of anonymity because he was not authorized to discuss the operation. According to the official, the depot housed Iskander and Tachkayu missiles, as well as glide bombs and artillery shells. He said the facility caught fire in the strike and was burning across an area 6 kilometers wide. Among the destroyed ammunition were North Korean KN-23 short-range ballistic missiles, another official, in Ukraine's intelligence office, told AP. He also was not authorized to comment publicly and didn't provide evidence to support his claim. Russia and North Korea signed a landmark pact in June that envisioned mutual military assistance between Moscow and Pyongyang. There was a drone attack on the city of Toropets, Tver region of Russia. Local telegram channels reported on this. It is said that Ukrainian drones attacked the territory of the military unit. As a result of the kamikaze drone strikes, explosions and fires occurred in ammunition warehouses. At a warehouse in Toropets in the Tver region, the Russians stored missiles for Grads and S-400s, as well as Iskanders, and they also began storing North Korean KN-23S there. It is reported that the city population living nearby is ready to evacuate. It is difficult to evacuate some of them. Local authorities have partially evacuated residents of Toropets in Russia's Tver Oblast after a mass drone attack overnight caused a large fire, Tver Oblast Governor Igor Rudinya claimed. Photos and videos shared on Russian telegram channels showed a number of explosions and a large plume of smoke, purportedly at the site of an ammunition depot in Toropets. The Kyiv Independent could not immediately verify the location of the explosions. Toropets has a population of 11,000, and is situated around 470 kilometers north of the Ukrainian border and over 370 kilometers west of Moscow. A fire started as a result of drone wreckage falling while air defense forces were repelling an attack, Rudinia claimed on Telegram at 3.30 a.m. local time, adding that the situation was under control. At 4 a.m. local time, Rudinia announced the decision to partially evacuate the population from the territory where air defense is operating and the fire is being localized, as air defense continued to repel a massive attack of drones in the sky above the city. The necessary measures are being taken. The situation is under control. According to state media outlet RIA Novosti, the population was being evacuated to the town of Zapadnaya Dvina, 35 kilometers southeast of Toropets. Russia's defense ministry claimed that 54 Ukrainian drones had been downed overnight, but did not mention any drones downed over Tver Oblast. According to the Russian defense ministry's 8 a.m. report, 27 drones were downed over Kursk Oblast, 16 over Bryansk Oblast, 7 over Smolensk Oblast, 3 over Belgorod Oblast, and 1 over Oryol Oblast. Kiev did not comment on Moscow's claims, but Ukraine is known to use domestically produced drones to strike targets deep inside Russia. 
A previous drone attack on Tver Oblast reportedly targeted a major chemical research plant. Images and videos shared by local residents on Russian telegram channels appeared to show a large explosion on June 27 near Rudkino, home to the Redkinsky plant. At the time, Rudinia only claimed that a drone was downed over Konikovsky district in Tver Oblast, the same area in which the Redkinsky plant is located.